Now, it's time to delve deeper into the architecture of the Badder platform. Badder extends and opens the features of Samsung's powerful mobile platform inside the vast majority of our mobile devices. In this new Badder architecture, there are four main abstraction layers. Kernel, device, service, and then, of most interest to developers like you, the framework. Badder will play an important part in the future of Samsung. It will ship on a range of different hardware devices and has been designed to support a variety of underlying, kern underlying kernels, including RTOS and Linux. This makes it a highly flexible, scalable solution capable of adapting to the hardware requirements of now and in the future. On top of this is the device layer, and this contains all the core functions that you would typically find in an open mobile platform, including security, graphics, audiovisual, and multimedia management. At the service layer, the power and potential of Samsung Better starts to become more apparent. In addition to standard higher level services such as messaging, contact management, and web runtime, we also see services such as location, context, social, and billing, all made possible thanks to the back end Samsung operated servers that are so tightly integrated into the Badder platform. And finally, sitting at the top of our new platform is the OpenAPI framework. It's here where our invitation to adventure lies. For the first time, third-party developers can target Samsung's mass market devices with standard C++ APIs, giving you the opportunity to create a vast number of applications. With Badder, what you have is a platform crafted from the ground up to allow developers to create feature-rich applications that can run on a wide range of devices. <laughs>